rumours, so I'm going to get through this quickly. For the first time in 30 years, the world's most prestigious ballet competition, the Prix de Fontaine, will be held in Sydney. Preliminaries are at the end of the semester, followed by the Nationals, where it will be decided who goes on to represent Australia. The Academy and the company have been asked to be part of the launch tomorrow. Sebastian is choreographing. The least I can do for the new principal of the Academy. And the international judges will be in the audience. I cannot stress enough that we will be representing the entire dance community. This is your chance to make a lasting impression. It's here. After nine months of training and agonising over our solos. The national finals of the Prix de Fontaine. Judgment Day. Only two girls and two boys out of the entire country will make it through to the internationals. And the worst part, that all of our technique, our artistry, our individuality. The judges take these hard-earned things and transform them into cold, unforgiving numbers. Grace Whitney, National Academy, Classical Round. 7.7. 7.7. Seven point six. Six point nine. Eight point nine. Thank you, Michael Slade, Tasmanian School of Dance. The Slade is spoken. Beat that. We care about the students, the but they hate oh, us. It's so rigged. It's ridiculous. Just, just calm down. Zach, we're not seven. Whoa, you might be, but we're not. What? We're playing favorites. No, ben, you're over yourself, right? Stuff like that. Else it's rigged. Time. Enough! It's not... I agree you've been marked harshly, but there's no excuse for whining. Are we keeping you, Miss Armstrong? I will be making inquiries with the committee as to whether there is bias involved. As the National School, we enjoy certain privileges. It can work against us. However, that's not your concern. You are going to suck it up and focus on the contemporary round tomorrow. Heading into the final day of the Nationals, to avoid any disputes about influence, fictional or otherwise, the judging panel will keep their scores private. Results will be announced at the end of competition today. Benjamin Tickle, National Academy. <sighs> Don't hurt yourself. T, that must have been some seaside adventure. We're on the friends ladder. Yeah, no, he didn't just look at you like a friend. suddenly all over you. Because he's enchanted by her winsome charms. He's trying to psych me out. Really? I'm so hideous that no one would ever like me unless there's an agenda. And why, pray tell, would it psych you out, boyfriend? That's the thing, it wouldn't. Just don't get hurt, okay? Ignore him. The competition is warping his brain.
So I'm thinking, if anyone was to have the skillage to cross ladders, it'd be you. How would that work? Well, um, the ladders, they would, they would have to be pretty close. And then if, if you just leaned over, or I could. Next to the stage, Christian Reed, the National Academy. Tell me you didn't just do that to mess with Christian. What? No. I mean, asking you to the beach was, it was, it was a tactic. But it, it didn't end like that. Stop was... talking. This crush, or whatever it was, is officially over. Once again, the slate is superior. Not with that headband. Samuel Lieberman, National Academy. They say it's good for the heart, they say it's good for the How about, how about we make this an immersive experience and you guys just imagine the music? There's this argument that there shouldn't be competitions in ballet because it's an art, not a sport. The following four dancers will be representing Australia in the international round of the Prix de Fontaine. But competition brings out the best in some people. The part I don't like is ranking everyone best to worst. In the girls section, the silver medal is awarded to Grace Whitney, National Academy. But I might just be saying that right now to prepare myself for disappointment. And the gold medal goes to Tara Webster, also from National Academy. In 
the boys' section. The silver medal goes to Michael Slade, Tasmanian School of Dance. which um, he'll collect later. And the gold medal is awarded to Samuel Lieberman, National Academy.